inside those walls, there's 669 positive cases of COVID-19. That was nine days ago. And today, there are 1,444 positive cases in the Central Michigan Correctional Facility, more than doubling the amount in a prison of just over 2,500 inmates. The Michigan Department of Corrections says it's under control. So uh, the warden and his team have been doing uh, a great job of doing everything they can to, to limit the spread. But mothers with sons inside say otherwise. They're being inhumanely treated. They should be taking bigger precautions. Um, and I don't feel that they're doing that. Annette Cox's son, Robert, tested positive. He also has asthma. That's heartbreaking. We understand that. Uh, we understand that we are dealing with human beings. Uh, these prisoners are human beings and we're doing everything we can. But when I asked Annette how she feels. Helpless. <laughs> Helpless. Um, my son is no angel, but he doesn't deserve to be treated as poorly as he's being treated there. MDOC says they are providing all inmates with a multivitamin every day and that the medical staff is periodically checking on them. In St. Louis, Kendall Keyes, WNEM TV5.